When you collect GeoTrace data using ODK Collect or Kobo Toolbox, you can easily display this line data, this uh, GPS line in QGIS. In this video, I'm going to quickly show you how to do that. If you're a humanitarian or development worker, I'd love for you to subscribe to this channel to get weekly updates on data collection, analysis, or visualization specifically for our sector. <laughs> You have downloaded a, a file, a CSV file from Kobo Toolbox or your ODK server. Um, so I've just pulled it open in Excel here and I'm just zooming over here to this um, column where we have collected GeoTrace data. So this is from a GeoTrace question. So if you're in QGIS, what you want to first do is go to plugins and go to manage and install plugins. And in the search bar up here, start typing ODK and something will come up called ODK trace to WKT. If you click on that and click on install plugin, then click on close. You'll actually see a little icon will probably come up. So it's that little blue arrow, but you can also then click on plugins and you'll see it here. Uh, so I, what I want you to do is click on that. So it says convert GeoTrace to well-known text. Click on that and you want to open your input file. So that's the one that we've downloaded from um, Kobo Toolbox or your ODK server. Click on open. Uh, column with GeoTrace. So we want to select the column that had that data. So that was trace example. So that's where we collected our GeoTrace data. The delimiter, you can leave it as a semicolon. And then output file, it will just create a temporary output file. So we're going to click on OK. And you can see, OK, output created. Great. We'll click on OK again. Uh, you can see that we have an output layer here. And on the map, we've actually added these two little lines. Uh, so what you want to do, because this is just a temporary file, right click on output layer and go to export and save features as and then you can use the format esri shapefile so that's great click on these little three dots here and wherever you want to save it just say geotrace example um, or name it whatever you want click on save and then you can choose which columns from your ODK or Kobo toolbox file you want associated with this line. I'm going to leave everything selected and then I'm just going to click on, oh, one more thing, add save file to map. Just make sure that's still clicked um, or ticked off. Um, so it will actually just add it to our map. Click on OK and then you'll see it pop up over here. And then I'm just going to right click on output layer. So on that temporary file, I'm just going to remove it from our map. Uh, OK. Uh, so there we have our lines, they're saved, and now we can actually just manipulate this here. So that is how to add GeoTrace data from Kobo Toolbox or ODK Collect into QGIS. Hope that was really helpful. And again, if you're a humanitarian or development worker, I'd love it if you subscribe so you can get weekly updates um, and support from me here. Uh, see you soon. Bye. Yeah.